hey guys and welcome back to my channel so in today's video as you guys read in the title i'm going to be doing a day in my life covid edition i unfortunately got covid for the first time in june late june of 2022 honestly my symptoms sorry my voice right now oh gosh and honestly my symptoms have not been very bad i just like you know thought i had a cold there's a little bit of the sore throat going on and then i just got like pretty congested and then i woke up today feeling a lot better today's day three i believe so i'm just gonna be taking you guys through like a typical day with covid just how i entertain myself and foods i eat because my appetite has changed a little bit just because i can't smell as well like food tastes different do you guys know what i mean and i don't know maybe give you guys some tips if you guys also have covid and, and right now it's 9 a.m and i'm about to do some journaling and stuff and then afterwards i think i'm going to eat breakfast take my medicine do my daily juice shot make coffee all of those kind of things guys my mom is the cutest she just sent me a little room service menu which is so sweet um because like i said I'm trying not to be in like common areas like out to the kitchen. All right, so I'm about to take my medicine. I of course got my emotional support water bottle with me. I'm gonna take my medicine, the Advil cold and sinus. It's been working wonders. All right guys, this is my setup. I have my fan right here. This thing is amazing because the sun room gets so hot. And then of course we have remotes hand sanitizer, and then my little breakfast tray with my pancakes, strawberries, maple syrup, utensils, coffee I made. Even though the coffee, it tastes really weird because I can't smell. I made it well, it's just, I literally can barely taste it, but that's okay. All right guys, I'm gonna do a juice shot right now. So good, so yum, immunity, ginger cayenne juice shot. I've been taking these every single day since I've had COVID and I have a bunch stocked in the fridge and these make me feel so like i don't even know they, they make me feel like really good I'm actually i'm pretty good at taking them they aren't the tastiest but it's like i feel so much better afterwards and even if it's like a little bit of like placebo it just makes me feel better so i just like doing it anyways grab a juice shot and do a juice shot with me right now oh my god that was not bad at all it was actually pretty tasty the aftertaste a little a little spicy right now but it was actually very good i'd definitely buy these again one of my favorite things to do recently um since having covid is watch new netflix trailers because i don't know why i just, i love finding out about like new tv shows and it's just like fun to watch like a little snippet of a show because i feel like i'm always on the lookout for like new good shows all right guys here's my crazy amazing very fashion forward off of the day I'm wearing this extra large, we can do it, Rosie the Riveter shirt. And then underneath, I'm just wearing these Brandy Mobile shorts. They're so comfortable. They have pockets and they're like waffle print. I love them so, so much. I definitely think I'm gonna buy another pair like online or something. So I just like got ready for the day. Basically just like changed out of my pajamas. I put in a little bit of eyebrow gel, like brushed out my hair and styled it a little bit. I think now I'm gonna do like a to-do list for today. It's not gonna be anything too, too crazy because I should be like rusty and stuff or whatever, which as you guys can tell, I'm not loving, but I, I'm gonna put together a list of things that I can work on. Um, and then I think I might keep watching YouTube for a little bit longer and yeah. We'll just see where the day takes us. All right, guys. So now I'm watching Dora move-in vlogs because I have been so obsessed with these. I'm actually working on putting together a dorm list with my roommate. And, like, we're picking, like, oh, what we're bringing and stuff like that. Like, picking my dorm aesthetic. And, yeah, even though it's not that important, I just think it's really fun. I've been so obsessed with, like, college move-ins. I mean, it kind of makes sense because I'm moving in in less than two months. So, you guys will a thousand percent be getting a move-in vlog. Like, oh my god. It's gonna be so crazy that you guys will be coming on this journey with me because I've had this channel since eighth grade and now I will be a freshman. I'm, I mean, I am gonna be a freshman in like less than two months, a freshman in college. So that is crazy in seven weeks. I will be moving in. 
to my dorm at SCSU. I actually still don't even know what dorm I'm living in, but I, I heard they're sending out what dorms you'll be living in in the next week. Honestly, I literally don't care what dorm I'll be in because I'm just excited to like have that college experience and honestly, all the dorms are great. Yeah, I feel like I'm kind of spending a lot of time like planning my dorm and decor and stuff, but I know it's important to me to create a space that's gonna feel like homey, that's gonna feel like me. And it's just like fun, like I love interior design and stuff. I grew up watching like an insane amount of HGTV. So I'm bringing my, my talents to dorm decorating. Also, I feel like my room right now is just really not my aesthetic anymore. I really wanna make my college dorm like an accurate presentation of me. But also the issue is I feel like I fit in with so many aesthetics and I like so many aesthetics that I'm just like really unsure. But right now I'm thinking of going for like a preppy kind of aesthetic i think me and my roommate might coordinate or something like that um because i think like a preppy fun like bright pops of color but there's also like a beachy aesthetic that i'm like well that's also cute because i'll be living by the beach and blah, blah 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 but it really just matters like what's gonna stand the test of time and also i'll be living there for a year so it's like is it really that important i don't know but <laughs> yeah Oh my gosh, you guys can hear in my voice how congested I sound. I swear, I don't even feel very congested, but I just sound like crazy congested. I don't feel that bad right now, I just feel congested, and I've also been staring at my phone for a long time. It's like 12 right now, I was just creating like a little Instagram draft for my Mexico post, and I was looking on Pinterest, doing random stuff, online shopping. Guys, I have literally been dorm shopping all day. I've been looking on Dormify, but also like Amazon, just like a bunch of different places to kind of like gather some inspo. Current search, I'm starting to watch How I Met Your Father and then my mom brought me some dinner. Forgot to show lunch. It was basically just like red pasta and then I had some tri cereal for a snack. Um, but I'm literally having Caesar salad with chicken and then some grapes and then my water, obviously. This is like my fourth Yeti of the day. Also, I like watching on my iPhone better than watching on the TV, so like don't hit on me. I just love skipping 10 seconds. That feature is amazing. Love my little iPad because I can just like hold it in my hand. All right, guys, I feel like I have not given any updates in like so long, but currently I'm just watching a little movie and just like relaxing. It's like 10 to 11. In a few minutes, I'm going to just do a bit of reading before bed because I really, really try not to be on like a screen like 30 minutes before I want to go to sleep just because I want to make sure I get enough sleep tonight because I've been waking up pretty early just because of the time change being in Mexico and being here and I know that not being on my screen will help me do that and I'm also going to do some journaling the prompt that I've been using lately writing down a like at least 10 item gratitude list writing like what went well today or like good things that happened today and then i also write like things i can improve on and i write a list of like things i could have done better or like just like upsets or challenges that happened in the day and i find that really really helps me it's only day three so yeah it's a little bit rough but it's okay we're getting through it the dorm shopping has definitely been helping me it takes up so much time to just like figure out what I'm gonna get but I think I've decided on these like some posters um like a duvet like cover and stuff I'll see you guys tomorrow I actually think I'm gonna continue the vlog into tomorrow just because I want to get more of like a comprehensive view of with COVID and I want to show you guys like different alternative activities you can do besides like being on your phone and I feel like I haven't really shown that today so definitely tomorrow I'm gonna try to do that also guys one of my favorite things to do is in my garage I have like a bunch of like clothes in this big bin in my garage since trends like go in and out so quickly I literally go through things from there from like three years ago and be like oh wait that's so cute like I just found a tube top and a skirt that I'm like, oh my gosh, like I'm totally taking that out of the donation bin. And it's just like fun to like shop in like your garage or attic or whatever and like find new things or like like room decor and stuff like that too. It's like so fun and it's like a pastime for me, I swear. <laughs> I also 
also i think i'm gonna maybe work on my photo collage or something and add some more photos up here that is also another really really fun thing to do just like order photos off of like walgreens they always are having like discount codes and get them for super super cheap and like print them out also just love like when you have all this extra time like this like organizing things like organizing things in your room or like looking through your closet and like going through your clothes getting rid of stuff or like it's just so fun like discovering things like you forgot you had cleaning organizing all of that and yeah i will see you guys tomorrow all right guys i just finished doing some stranger things theorizing with my dad because right now as i'm filming this stranger things is coming out tomorrow at midnight i'm just going to shake up my zoo shot of the day yeah, today is day four. Just have this no joke ginger shot from Trader Joe's. These ones are my favorite, but they're like pretty spicy. The one thing I like about them is they're inexpensive, so that's really nice. As for my check-in for today, I honestly feel the same as yesterday. My voice feels a little bit worse and I feel a little more tired than yesterday, so kind of just like feel the same. Anyways, so my intention today is to go outside, try not to be on my phone as much. I also really want to edit as well. Cheers. One, two, three. Here's today's setup. I'm sorry, I know these look so unappetizing, but I have strawberries. And then I also have my coffee. Um, I just got an iced latte with oat milk and two pumps of caramel. 